Are you the kind of person that excels in their role, right? The technical part, you have it down packed, but you struggle with asserting your authority. You struggle with asserting your confidence. I've been through it, right? When I started my career, I was technically very sound. You can tell me otherwise, and you still can't actually, but I lacked that inner confidence, that inner power to assert myself and to assert my authority in meetings and to speak out loud for the things and the ideas that I thought were good and genuine and sound and that could be successful. And I learned very quickly that if you do not assert yourself, people will not let you and you may be stepped on, you may be walked all over, or you may even be overlooked altogether. And the problem with not asserting yourself, asserting your confidence and asserting things that you want and don't want is that life ends up taking you places and you are not the one driving, right? You end up in an Uber and you do not know the direction. You do not know the destination you do not even know the driver so one thing i learned is know your destination and let the universe guide you towards it know where you want to go have that definite purpose that definite aim in mind and be able to confidently say this is where i am this is where i want to go and confidently talk in meetings Confidently talk to your colleagues, your supervisors, to your friends, to the people in your family, right? Confidently say, this is where I want to go. I do not necessarily know how to get there yet, but I will figure it out. If it's at work, you probably should know how to get there before you say, this is where you want to go. Show up, but also speak up. Speak up for yourself. Speak up for the things you want, the things you do not want, because nobody else will for you. So learn that. And if you can't learn that, fake it till you're able to make it. I'm Linda Pointing, and that was my nugget for you today.